Fight all the crime you want. It's gonna fight back. It's comics and shots. A completely improvised, semi-comedic amusing. By Howard Stern's Mick the Nerd and YouTube and TikTok's Mick the Man. Today's subject, Orc Stain. No, not Eric Larson's Orcs, which cribs off it. Yeah, I went there. Orc Stain, an obscure image comic from the 2000s about a world where it's all orcs all the time. All the time, orcs, all the time, everywhere, it's all happening. And it's pretty interesting because, like, the thing that just sticks in my memory of the comic, and if you read the comic, you know what I'm talking about. Their currency is chopped up dicks. The currency in Orc Stain is chopped up dicks. It's like, they chop up a dick, a big old meaty dick, and like the, it was like, you got the chits that are like the, like the, the shaft of the dick, and the head is called the bell, which is worth like five times as much. And someone agreed to publish that, and I'm glad, because that's stuck in my imagination. Really, the artwork is really beautiful and gory, and the main character, whose name I can't remember, is pretty cool. I think his name was One Eye or something. You could, like, see weaknesses and stuff. It was great. But it was also a comic full of dicks. Just dicks all the time. All the time. Penises. Penises everywhere. Some vaginas, but mostly penises. And there was a witch who had, like, a furry friend on her head. And I can't remember if she was a friend of the main character or not. Nah. It only lasted like, I don't know, maybe like 12 issues, and they didn't collect all the issues in trade paperback form, which is a shame. Which is a shame. Because you need to see a comic. Read or see a comic. It could be like one of those, you know, stupid comic reading videos on YouTube about a world of orcs where their p currency is dismembered penises dipped in gold. Why don't they just mold gold from the coins? I don't know. It's orc stain, baby. You just gotta roll with it. Yeah. With that, like, comment, and subscribe. Donate if you're feeling nice. And I'll always remember, praise be to the blood elk. Will Charlie forgive Vaggy tomorrow in Hasbend Hotel? Wait and see.